Blue Light is a not-for-profit charity organisation with 27 branches and 7 sub-branches statewide. Blue Light assists young people to reach their potential by breaking down the barriers between police and young people in a fun, safe environment. Christie's Beach Blue Light holds two different events. There's one for our young kids, for five to 12 year olds, and that's a movie disco where they have a disco followed by a movie. Then there's the underage rage events for our 11 to 16 year olds. So I'm the chairperson of the Blue Light. I basically am the event coordinator, so I coordinate all of our volunteers. So at a movie disco event, we'd have around 10 volunteers. Then at an underage rage, we have around 50 volunteers. And I coordinate them during the event and look after any youth that may want to leave or if any incident happens. The underage rage events, they normally are fairly trouble free, being that the kids are, are used to coming to our events, they know that it's a lock-in from 7pm to 10pm, they know that we won't tolerate any bad behaviour because it is about having a drug-free, alcohol-free, safe event. We won't tolerate any trouble and um, our focus is just to keep everyone safe and have a good time. I volunteered at um, a few blue light discos, uh, the underage rages. Yeah, I really enjoy uh, the blue light discos. You get to uh, have fun with the kids rather than policing them. I don't know if the kids like my dancing. I think it's a bit outdated now. I need to learn how to shuffle a bit better. Um, but apart from that, yeah, no, nah, it's good fun. Do the macarena and uh, the chicken dance and stuff. The money that we raise from the kids' entry into the disco goes back into our community. So in the way of blue light camps, we run several camps a year. Some are for leadership students, some are for disadvantaged or at-risk youth. And those camps are about building a positive rapport with police and also developing their leadership skills. There's a lot of benefit to the young people. It's great to have a bit of a fun time with them as well as providing this for them and it is an event that we need down here in the south. And now being a part of the committee and being the chairperson, I enjoy being able to give that money back to the community in the way of camps and, and other things like that. The Splashdown event is something that's uh, been recently launched and is just a different form of the uh, traditional pool party or disco. What the uh, Splashdown event does is takes a whole group of young people and goes through some aquatic activities in a fun, safe environment. It's basically having fun at the uh, pool aquatic centre and we do maintain a crime prevention focus and that's providing a message to our young people that um, responsible behaviour is the way to go and make sure that everyone enjoys themselves but also that they are safe. Blue Light Rangers is a youth program for young people between 12 and 18 years of age. Uh, the program is set up to give uh, young people an insight into the roles and responsibilities of police officers in society and also give the uh, kids a chance to interact directly one-on-one -on -one with police. We meet on a Friday night where we'll have a physical training stream which gives kids a chance to get out, get a bit of PE, play a sport. And we also have an academic stream where the kids will study modules which are very similar to that which they teach in the police academy. Um, at the end of the night they have a drill session uh, where the kids will get to do some marching which they use the marching skills for uh, things like Anzac Day, D-Day Parade. Um, we're not just based here on a Friday night, we also participate in community parades, Christmas pageants, local fates, a whole range of things. Uh, the thing I like most about the Blue Light Rangers is probably the community events. In the last three years I've gained great leadership skills, communication skills. I come to Blue Light Rangers because I want a career in the police force and coming here is helping me to achieve my dream career. We see a lot of kids come in that are more than 12, 12 year old age and they lack confidence and maybe some social skills, even discipline. So wearing the uniform teaches them to look after things and it gives them a sense of pride and presentation as well as 
doing that, they develop their confidence with other kids of both the same age and older. And if they get promoted, that gives them a chance to work with all different age groups. I think they think it's a bit of a party. <laughs> um, yeah, I think that's a big incentive for them. Spend the day with their friends at a community event whilst helping with the Blue Light Rangers, which will help them later in life. Blue Light is more than just this goes. Over the time it has grown into a whole variety of programs, camps and other activities. And what we'd like Blue Light to uh, demonstrate to the community is that uh, we have moved forward and we are becoming safer, more professional and we're uh, growing with what we do.